Well, hi all. Um, just getting ready for the brew day on Saturday. Uh, I'm going to make a black IPA and just getting the greens ready. I always find them a bit rushed and I just uh, do it at the spur of the moment. And I thought I'd be a little bit more prepared because um, I've been making mistakes lately and um, things like not uh, getting the correct ABV in the last English brew, which I don't want to do. Okay, also uh, I've just hit uh, 300 subs. Um, I've not been looking to get free of subs, I've not been trying to push the channel or anything, but it's nice to get that and uh, thank you for subscribing and uh, please uh, hang around and uh, hopefully have an interesting brew day in a few days time. But I'm just going to show you the ingredients today and I may even talk about other things. Okay, so have a look. So um, I've concocted a recipe, uh, I'm using uh, Marisotta, I'm going to be using some other grains and things, but I'll show you the recipe. Hopefully, you can see this. Um, so I, I got it to a, a beer spear, and I've uh, typed in a black IPA. You can see I've more or less got the um, the all down the middle of the road here. Uh, so I'm doing 5.4 kilograms of Marisotto. I'm gonna do chocolate malt. I've got got some crystal malt from. Um, a woman's to maltings this weekend. It's a 400 EBC crystal malt, so I'm going to try some of that. Uh, apparently, it's quite nice. I've got uh, roasted barley and chocolate, like I said. I, with my roasted barley and the chocolate, I'm going to grind that up very fine and stick it in right at the end of the mash. Um, I'll have to turn the mash, turn the circulation off, take the top off, put the grains in, and uh, carry on recirculating for a bit. I don't know how I'm going to do that. It's going to be difficult, I'll have to see. Anyway, uh, also I'm going to stick, uh, to lighten it up a little bit, I'm going to stick some uh, rice, rice flakes. I've got loads of it here, so uh, I want to have a go. I read somewhere that somebody mentioned that they did put sugar or rice in, into an IPA to lighten it up a bit, so it's not quite as heavy and doesn't turn to kind of a stout. Um, Safel use uh, US05. Um, I'm using... Centennial to a bitter up a bit, but also I'm intermingling a bit of mosaic to get the IBO up, up to about about 70 almost. I'm um, looking for an estimated ABV of about 7% and an original gravity of 1065. Now there's a limit on the uh, Brammeister, you can't stick more than 6 kilograms in. So I've got, I've got just adjust the figures so it says 6 kilograms. Um, I'm going to mash at 65, I'm going to do some water adjustments and things like that, and that's about it. I think I'm also going to be dry hopping with some mosaic at the end. Um, so yes, uh, look forward to seeing you all Saturday, hope you're all doing well. I've got some beer reviews to do here from... Um, from some guy out of Sweden, I'll tell you his name when I remember it, and um, hopefully he's even going to get some of mine. So that will be coming up very soon, uh, and I'll see you all soon. Okay, have a good Friday. Bye.